Lorena Escalera, October 14, 1986, May 12, 2012, known professionally as Lorena Stravaganza, was a Puerto Rican transgender performer known for her impersonations of Beyonce and Jennifer Lopez. She was given the last name Stravaganza for her membership of a celebrated group called the House of XTRAVAGANZA. Lorena posthumously rose to mainstream attention after her murder in 2012. She was found unconscious and unresponsive in her Bushwick apartment. Escalera's apartment was set on fire after she had been strangled and suffocated. Biography Lorena was born in Puerto Rico, moving to New York City when she turned 18 years old. Escalera had been working as a makeup artist in Puerto Rico but wanted to come to New York City to broaden her career as a performer and model. Once arriving, Lorena joined the renowned performance house, The House of Extravaganza, which were featured in the popular 1990 documentary, Paris is Burning. She began walking balls and competing for prizes as an extravaganza, picking up the name Lorena Stravaganza from fans. Extravaganza also had a career as a model, although it is not known to the public what she modeled for. Murder on May 11, 2012 She brought two men to her apartment at 43 Furman Avenue in Bushwick, the police said. At about 4 a.m., a fire broke out in the apartment. A passerby ran into the four-story building and began banging on doors, according to a neighbor. In the ensuing chaos, everyone seemed to emerge from the building. Except Lorena. Firefighters arrived, as did officers from the 83rd Precinct. When the blaze was extinguished, at 4.37 a.m., Lorena was discovered unconscious and unresponsive and paramedics declared her dead at the scene. A fire department spokesman said that firefighters using thermal imaging equipment found the body on a bed. Though the fire has been deemed suspicious, investigators have found no evidence of accelerant. The police were still awaiting a determination on the cause from fire marshals. Lorena's roommate said that when work was done on the electrical system, they created holes around the electrical outlets and filled them with cardboard. The whereabouts of Lorena's two visitors were not known, though a neighbor said he was told by the passerby that two men were arguing in front of the building at the time of the fire. Media coverage The New York Times article covering Lorena's death was criticized by GLAAD for being transexploitation. See also list of unsolved murders. References External links Lorena's Stravaganza on IMDb